If someone criticizes you for being overly intellectual or overly verbose, how should you react to that? When someone says to you, you should be castrated, how should you react to that? It occurs to me maybe just to me, that when someone says that, they have emotional problems. That they are sick in the head. But, don't we all feel that way sometimes? Someone so enrages us, so enrages our sensibility of right and wrong, that we want to lash out at them, and we want to punish them for even daring to think such a thing even daring to think such a thing. You cannot think that. It is wrong to think that thought. You cannot think that. Ooh, you cannot think that. Emotions play a part in every action we make. We are, if nothing else, emotional creatures. It is this denial of our emotions that is as dangerous as not being reasonable. We believe as a matter of emotional desire. I'm not criticizing. I'm simply acknowledging I am susceptible to my emotions. When I am trolled, and as I have said and I will continue to say, I like trolls. Trolls allow you to feel emotion, but they also illustrate what they think is your weakness. A troll attacks you to get your emotions to the surface, to engage you at an emotional level, to ask you to feel. What does it feel like to be such an asshole? I get that. A troll is an opportunity to think. Hmm. It's an opportunity to feel. Why do people troll? For many reasons. But in a way, we are all trolls. We are all looking for human connection. We are talking to the world. No longer are we isolated into a single local family. We can extend our family across the world, across the globe, into the human family. And this is the power and the magic of the internet. Trolls want to shut you down. Trolls want you to be afraid. Trolls want you to stop what you're doing. Because what you're doing is you're asking, let us all be friends. I want the whole world to be a part of my life. I want to be remembered as being here. I am here. When people criticize YouTube, they say, well, they're just YouTube attention whores. And I love that term, attention whore. But we're all attention whores. And that's okay. It's okay to want to have attention. It's okay. And understand that other people want attention too. And when you comment on people's videos, when you like people's videos, when you go out of your way to comment, it makes them feel good. Whether they tell you or not, it makes them feel good. I don't take a negative comment negatively. I think, wow, that person actually thought enough of what I said to comment. Even if it's a negative comment, it brought an emotion to the bear in them. An act, say, well, I want to say something negative to this person because they made me feel, and I didn't want to feel that. Or maybe they did want to feel that. So here's to the trolls. Keep trolling, guys. But one day, you'll realize it's not that much fun. 
and you'll want to engage as well. But remember, for those that don't want to troll, that they want to create good content. Don't be afraid of the troll. Don't be afraid of the troll. Embrace the troll. Go through the troll and become a better person.